Welcome back, my lovelies, to episode number five of our look at the Raft first chapter update. Very big update. Um, kept us going for quite a while. We're halfway through exploring Balboa Island. Last time, we turned on two relay stations and fought a lot of bears. So now we're going to um, get to the final relay station. Let's have a look at the map. We've done four and two, and we just need to do six. Um, yeah, so all good. Also found wild berries. I didn't actually realise that's actually a, a quest item. And we have got rid of all our matey boy tools. I forgot what his name is now. <laughs> but we we filled a wall up with some tools. Um, there. That explains that. I think you'll agree. Let's start doing a bit of cooking. Just so I can take some meat with us. Also... Grab some water, drink some water, and grab some bonus water as well to take with us. I think we should be fine. Oh, one thing I can do. We can finally craft the end, the last of our armour. Now we killed, we killed so many bears. We've got leather for days. And of course the wool, the llama up above. Oh, we can see the shadow of him just there. Um, he's been providing us with wool. So we just need to make the body armour. Craft that. And we have the full set. No bears will be able to touch us anytime soon. Just check the shark isn't um, nibbling. No, nope, I think we should be fine. Hello, engine. You served as well. I mean, I eventually got it to bloody well work. After all that um, major misunderstanding with the wood. Which at least nobody pointed that out. <sighs> right, anyway, anyway. So, we've done the relay station kind of like up to the, to the left of us. And we did the one that's kind of on the other side of some goo. So we just need to follow the signs to six, essentially. We're feeling emboldened because we've killed many bears. And we found many wild berries as well, which turned out to be luminescent at night. They glowed their pretty little faces off. I could not eat them, though. It was a shame, because they're quest items. So hopefully the bears won't have just, like, rampantly respawned all over the shop. I haven't... Been looking for signs. I really should probably look for signs. Don't want to go over there. Let's try and crawl our way through here. I don't know how vicious the respawning is. So there's one. There's one bear I've definitely not fought, and that's the sitting bear that I kept on seeing. Didn't get close enough to activate it though. But I have a feeling we'll probably end up fighting him. So there's actually some stuff there. That's the stuff that we came across first time we saw a bear. And this may be taking us back up to the. The, uh, the chemical waste. So, if, yeah, that's the that's the waste one. So let's bring our thing up. So that, I think, is number two. So we need to basically go in the exact opposite direction. So is that it then, up there? Uh, maybe. Well, let's have a go. Oh dear, this is bad. Ow. Well, there goes my ankles. Let's have a bit of a peek. Four and six this way. It should be okay. So I think it, I think it's six. Right, go up here. If this is another repeat, I've already done this. I can only apologise. Oh, this looks different. Is that bark? No, it's Mozart. <laughs> oh, is this that rubbish bit which I came up and there's nothing here? Oh, bloody hell. Let's go over here instead. I think... Oh, piss! That's the sitting bear! He's a much more vicious variety. Oh, shit. I think that bear's a, a worse bear. Ow! Well, I've lost quite a bit of stuff there. Thankfully, I've tried to keep it as light as possible. But this... I've lost my bow. Less than ideal. A lot less than ideal. Hmm. Well... Oh, come on! Not now, shark. That's less than fair. Hmm. Now a little period of rebuilding. So I'm taking a much lighter lot of stuff this time. I could have made more. I could have made more armour. 
But I think it's safer if we don't. So we don't lose anything. I think I can make a lot of this stuff. I mean, the, there's a bear again. I could definitely not get the armour back. I might be able to make one bit of armour, but not the whole load. So, back going this way. Now this is where we went last time, and then things took a turn. I think it was. De I think that's where the bear is. That's the sitting bear of doom. That seems to be twice as vicious as all the other bears. I'm gonna try and make my way above him, if that's the right route. Feels like I keep on seeing the same signs, and they're not necessarily correct. Or maybe they are. Maybe it's just me that's not correct. Well, let's avoid the sitting bear. Maybe it's nothing nowhere near where we need to be. Apparently, it's over here. Right, so I think the bears are respawning. Oh, it's all, all the way back here. Yeah, there's, there's a bear. I couldn't, didn't get a chance to see the sign. Full. Oh, the thing's broken. Damn it. My good... Sadly, my good spear is now Brock. Hup. Let's see if we can do it with a crappy old wooden... Oh, bloody hell, this ground pound is actually surprisingly nasty. Yeah, full. Leapt over that one. Ooh, right in the bush. Oh, this... Oh, fuck. Lads, 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 I've lost, I've lost my pole. Pole Brock. Huh. Can you get up here? Oh, you can. Huh. Run. Oh, it's... Oh, it did, it did a thing. Serpentine. It's behind me. Yeah, that way. Yeah. No. I forgot how quickly those wooden poles exploded. Oh, lavender. This is a new part of the island. Oh! Careful. Up. Oh, we may be able to outfox it. Or oh, outbear it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's buggered off into the distance. Hopefully. God, I'm defenceless now. And also, it's going dark. Oh, it's not the bear found a way! Shit. And now it's gone. Oh. <laughs> How mysterious. The bear there. I'm not gonna worry about it. So I'm guessing we go up there. <gasps> Cave. Which I probably won't be able to find anything in because I've no longer got my spade. <gasps> A machete required. Oh. Unfortunately I do not have the blueprint. Maybe that's the only way to get there. Shite. That's a bit unfortunate, isn't it? Maybe I've missed a blueprint then. In one of the existing islands. Or whatever they call them. Thingies. Relay stations. Well, maybe there's that bear we, we could try and work our way past. The second bear. God, there's lo what are these berries are for then? Because these are quest items. Oh, hello. What's this? Use five wild berries. Oh! Fair enough. Distraction. For what, though? I've still got loads of them. Somewhere. Oh, I've only got four left now. This is part of the island I haven't been on yet. Or at least a little spur. I was sort of heading back. Oh, this is that thing that we saw from a distance. Oh, mush mushies. Oh, honey! Bees! Yay. A jar of... A lovely packaged jar of honey. So presumably, I would not be able to do this very well if I hadn't distracted the bear. Bear! 
There's another bear. Mate. Hopefully I can just jump over rocks. Oh, fox it! Nope. They're out foxing for this little baby. Winnie. The poo! Missed me. Try and go up here. Hup. Ha! There's probably a way around for it to go that way. We shall go in the other direction. Is that that sitting bear? Oh, it's still, it's still at the berries. Oh god, the other bear's found me. Oh! We're still able to find me. I don't know what's down here, but who cares? <laughs> Just go for it. I think it's still on my back. I need to get home. I don't know if it's following me anymore. We may have got away with it. Right, I think I need to go home. I've come back. And look, that bear's still eating the berries, so I think there's definitely something. I don't think he was guarding the honey. Yeah, thought as much. That I did, there was actually another cave we never actually went into. So it looks like, um, yeah, that beyond that, that's where bees are, because I think honey seems to indicate where bees are. Oh, sorry, lavender indicates where bees are to get the honey. What's this? It's a slowy. Presumably this is to stop you trying to run past the bear instead of distracting it. Ah, I can now research machete. I should got oh, I got free machete. Oh, hello. Looks like it's made out of a registration plate. Excellent. Glad I came back here now. Well, the bear is still distracted, so... I mean, I've got four wild berries left over. I thought I might need another load of berries. or well, one more, anyway. So now I need to go back to number six. My sense of direction, which is, of course, uncanny, tells me that I'm probably already going in the wrong direction. Let's check. Oh, right. It's back the way I came. <laughs> oh, my life. Well, okay. Let's double check with that sign. Because those signs, they lie. Let's follow it over here. So the thing is, there's a couple of ways we can get up there. The long way and the short way. Guess which one we're going to take. So it's over here. And then I think we have to go over here. Yes. Up in the air here. I keep on coming to this bloody place. The place with the little little um, kid's maze thing. I think it's up there. We have to go round first. And here we are. This way again. Past a lot of lavender. Now where was it? <laughs> I think it was here. There we go. Surely this machete shall get us through. I'm running out of food and water. Yes. Yes. Take that. Oh, game. <laughs> I've got time for this. I have to eat the honey if nothing else. So I can come here for any sand or whatever the hell it is I need. Tonk. And we're here. The third tower. Hopefully we'll find that final instrument. And we'll also find the biofuel, whatever the hell I didn't find previously. Let's hope I manage to not fall off this time. Careful. We're doing it. We're not falling off. I'm a star, I am. Round here. Cross here. Past the distressing nuclear waste. For some reason I'm going up in the air now. <laughs> oh! Hinges and planks. Hinges and planks. I think this must be a bonus option. An optional bonus. One of the two. Oh! Station number six. Ah! Bruno's wrench. The final thing I was looking for. Radiator. Note! Seventh entry. Errol's gone! Miranda likes to act. Nothing's happened, but we know better. We all know better. Except, Bobby's gone awfully quiet, too. 
The triplets think I'm too quick to point fingers. Ninth entry. Henry and I took the auxiliary boat. Sorry, Alberte. I'm all alone out here. Bruno. Im of the tools. Ah, the fuel tank. Yay. Now I can make all the fuel stuff. Don't know which one I haven't read now. <laughs> one of the two. New note added. Caravan Island and more is coming in the second chapter. If you want to keep up with development, click our social medias below. So we've done it. We've come to the end of our little adventures in this the first chapter. So we would otherwise be a number. Caravan Town 6341. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, game. Make it a bit more obvious. So we actually do have a little bit of unfinished business because we do need to... um. Uh, take this instrument to one of the other relay stations. Okay, so next morning um, I've taken all my stuff, all my honey and everything, and put it in chests for safekeeping. Now, the final thing we need to do is sort out that whole tool, Bruno's tool situation. Now, I think I was reading the map wrong earlier. I think we may not actually be there. I think we might be there-ish. I think this is the channels that we can see ahead of us. So that's why I was um, I kept on going the wrong direction. Nothing to do with incompetence at all. Ish. Oh we've got enough wild berries now for to feed the bear even more, but I don't think we actually need that anymore. So I think I need to kinda of like go actually I might I might still be wrong with that whole thing. We still I think we need to go to tower number two, which is not the one there. Okay, so maybe um, maybe I think I need to... Yes, I know where I need to go. I need to basically go up there. Oh, is this the um the chemical waste one? Oh, bloody hell. Whew. Ow. Well. <laughs> Ow. Well, seem to have survived that. Now, th were the tools in here? Yes, they were. Woohoo! New note added. Merry Christmas from nowhere. B and A courier. Are those oh, those are the people who escaped. There, look, you. You're the seventh seventh of December to sixth of February, lads. Ah, isn't that nice? Doesn't help us though, does it? Damn it. <laughs> Did not find... Well, what was I... I don't think I was actually particularly looking for anything, was I? No, I just wanted to actually solve that little mystery. Well, the fact that there's um, lavender around here does suggest that there may be honey. I don't know. I don't really need honey. Oh, look, e even more wild berries. I think we should go and try and sort out the bloody fuel. I think we can actually leave the island now. I think we've. I think we've completed it completely now. Now, if we can just find the way back. I don't need to go up there again, do I? Nope, let's just... Let's go down the quick way. Which is jumping. This is a good spot you can actually see everywhere from here. No, it's, it's in the exact opposite direction. Hooray! Ow! Mate! One hit. This machete is really rather tasty. Just out of interest, I'm going to see how powerful it is. Maybe I need to use the blue... Oh yes, I actually do need to research the blueprint thing before we continue. Oh, I also learn all of these, in fact. Tonk, tonk, and tonk. Now we know how to do the machete. That's not too bad. I mean, that's comparable with the, the metal spear. Just ever so slightly more expensive metal-wise. As for the biofuel stuff, a lot of plastic is the main problem there. And the, but the actual tank itself, even more plastic. We are starting to run quite low on wood. I don't know. Anyway, what we'll do is think um, uh, is uh, we'll, do, we'll do one more episode of this update, I think, because there's still a bit more to do. I want to sail away and I want to set up my fuel and everything. But I also need to... Um, I've got a bit of honey here. 
But I don't seem to have anything in the way of potatoes, which we will need to actually fuel the thing. And that's going to be a whole thing, I think, because we'll need to find some other source of potatoes. I think you can find them... I think you can find them in just barrels, can't you? But we'll do that en route as we set sail for somewhere or other. Bye-bye, Bo Balboa Island. We can be back, because we can always use our engine. It's literally going to spit us out, isn't it? Don't even need to move anything. Because the wind is always against us. Aha! I found your secrets, you little prick. And that. Cool! Okay, so we'll see you in the next episode. Once it's killed. You! No. I'm too slow. It's actually a very slow um, choppy shop, this. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't dare. Alright, thanks for watching. Do um, subscribe to the channel, all the usual things. Check out my Patreon if you want to support us. Blah, 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 blah. Bye.